Global Banking and Finance Review Awards highlights the innovation, achievement, strategy, progressive and inspirational changes taking place within the global financial community. The awards were created to recognise companies of all sizes who have excelled in particular areas of expertise and excellence within the global financial community. This time we're pleased to offer Acolin AG an award for excellence. Headquartered in Zurich, Switzerland, Acolin Fund Management offer long experience, in-house experts, cooperation with supervisory authorities, Europe-wide distribution, access to investors and no conflict of interests. All these strengths offer major advantages to fund initiators. GBAF is glad to award Acolin an award for Best Fund Distribution Network, Western Europe 2017. We were pleased to welcome Victor Fisher, Deputy CEO of Acolin, to our London studios to receive the award from GBAF's Alexandra Kirciak. Later, we spoke to him about the company's success. Victor, welcome to London and indeed congratulations on your award from Global Banking and Finance Review. Thank you very much and I'm very honest and, and happy to be here today and to take this award. Thank you very much. Right, well, let's find out more about Acolin, first of all. First of all, how was it established and uh, what, how has it actually evolved? Okay. Acolin is a company which was established uh, somewhere more than 10 years ago. And the idea was to build up a distribution network for some smaller asset manager. Uh, and that was now 10 years ago. And today uh, we have somewhere 250 asset managers we work together and somewhere 80 asset managers using our distribution network management. But the idea was born somewhere 10 years plus ago. And how has it actually evolved? How has it developed now? So when, uh, when we got the mandate uh, 10 years ago, uh, we had direct mandate from asset manager. They had launched funds and they wanted us to build up a European distribution uh, platform in that way to, to really connect with distributors, uh, signing up agreements and really to grow assets. It was very fast identified at this time that for each of the asset manager and his funds, you have to sign up agreements. And then the idea was born, why not signing up one more global agreement with the distributor, might it be Deutsche Bank, might it be UBS, Credit Suisse, whatever, which then finally will allow that we, via our agreement, can include the funds of the different asset manager who mandated us. And that was the idea behind of Acolin, which has now been established more and more and is now more and more uh, entering in an excellence area. So you provide these excellent services. Uh, one of them would be presumably to reduce market entry time, to be precise. How do you actually uh, ensure that uh, with fund initiators? Absolutely. The thing is that due to the network we have now been establishing across Europe, we have those agreements. So if an asset manager decides with his funds to be on our network, he going to sign up with us once, we can take all his funds somewhere within a quarter to really, uh, uh, to really integrate them in our agreements, to provide all the data, the static and the dynamic data necessary that the other counterparty can establish it in the, in the own system, banking system, whatever. We do provide everything with regard to documentation, dissemination. We provide all the type of services around on that. And this, the advantage is that in, in principle, we can run this in one quarter. And normally, the asset manager, if he would go by himself alone, he would need then to do this uh, over 12, 15, 18 months because he would need to really, again, to visit all the distributors, convincing them, signing up agreements, providing all the data, all these type of things. And this is not necessary. So we can assure very fast entrance to the market. So that speeds things up a bit. Uh, what about the distribution network management? How does that operate? That's uh, exactly what, um, uh, what I mentioned is that we have been now signing up somewhere 250 agreements across Europe with counterparties. And, and uh, f uh, we, these, these agreements, they allowing us that we can integrate on a, on a regular basis, which is normally on a quarterly basis, all the funds from our clients' asset managers. Uh, that's the, the distribution network management and distribution network management does not include only the legal distribution agreement part, it does include also the 
data stuff, you know, all the static data, also now in our, in our wording now for 2018, all the MIFID data, the PRIPS data. So we do disseminate all these data to the distributors, but also we do assure commission management. So as long there are countries in Europe where you still are allowed to receive inducements on the non-independent advice. So we do calculate, we do reconciliation, we do everything around the inducement and commission management. But what is also very important, we assure also a compliance oversight reporting and infrastructure. So on each of our distributors, which is on the distribution network management, we do running initial due diligence, we do run ongoing due diligence, we do even run, uh, if necessary, on-site visits where we do assure that those counterparties are properly identified. Uh, we are assuring all necessary from a regulatory and we do provide on a quarterly basis oversight, compliance oversight reportings to the asset manager, to the manufacturer, to theirs, uh, departments uh, wishing on it. So very comprehensive services there and I know you have a lot of other th uh, things that perhaps yep. we should talk about. One of them will be Acolin Connect. Tell us okay. what that's about. Acolin Connect is also uh, 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 one of our babies which born uh, five years ago where we have been establishing a platform allowing the asset manager to make a presentation on himself and then connecting to the distributor. So the distributor has the possibility to connect to uh, Acolin Connect. At the same time, all our asset manager clients, they have uh, somewhere the possibility to market, to communicate and to talk about the capabilities. And so this is something Acolin is providing so that both sides can connect to each other via this digital world. So the asset manager has the possibility to inform about latest updates, uh, about investments, uh, all these type of things. And the, SM and the distributor who is looking for capabilities, he by himself connects. There will be a small due diligence on him that we can really identify that not someone else know, uh, is connecting. So that really only those ones to connect from the distributors who are on research departments, whatever, they need to be identified, they will be approved, and then they can then connect via Acolin Connect to the asset manager. And this is a type of communication distribution platform. Now, I can see that technology plays a very vital yeah. part in your day-to-day -day operations as it does in, in banking and, and financial control of all kinds. Uh, another service you provide is the Infotech division. What exactly is that? Aculin Infotech was built up uh, at the beginning of 2017. Uh, yes, it is our digital, it's our fintech part of Aculin, where we have been, uh, uh, where we have been putting in all IT infrastructure, all the data uh, departments, and we would like to be prepared for the digital world so that we can even support and provide more comprehensive uh, services to our clients and to assure that also the distribution, network management uh, counterparties receive in time all the data and so on. So we are preparing for the next uh, generation in that way, uh, which is very important that everything is digital, everything is via, via uh, online and these type of things to, to really assure efficiency. And does that tie in with the fund publication service? This is correct. So the, 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 the principal rule of Acolin is that we unique wise support the asset manager. So we are not a platform supporting a distributor. So our target and our business goal is always to support the asset manager. He's signing up with us once and that's important. So fun publication is our latest baby where we, uh, uh, where we do just comprehensive added another service to support the asset manager. So. Uh, from, a, from a usage uh, and from, from different regulation, it is mandatory to appoint, like in Switzerland, a publication agent, where on, on everything is available from a legal documentation, from NAVs, uh, if necessary, tax data, all these type of things. So it was something, a missing piece in our services to support the asset manager, which we established at the beginning of this year. 
which is uh, important. And we do also uh, offer this in, in, uh, in 17 countries in the EU, uh, which also somewhere is an obligation uh, from the usage world, from the uh, from the public, uh, from the uh, from the mutual funds, that somewhere you need to appoint a media agent somewhere. What would you say was unique about fund publications? Is it something which set it apart from other services? Um, I think yes, we have certainly we have uh, a, a very broad uh, um, access to different markets. Uh, we do also include uh, markets outside of Europe, so uh, it's going to be in, it's Singapore and, and Hong Kong. I think what is unique is somewhere it is unique for our clients because somewhere Acolin is the golden source. They only need to sign up once, and then we will provide all these services. So we are acting as a middle a middle office service for them on the distribution side. And this is unique that we to really support and help them. And from that point of view, fund publication, yes, of course, it's, it's something which is uh, as a source and as, as, a, uh, as an efficiency from the asset manager. So that what we believe it is really unique in that way, uh, uh, also from, from languages point of view, from access uh, to the market. Well, you've had a continued success and growth. What are your plans for the coming year regarding... That's a very good growth? question. Thank you very much. <laughs> of course. Now, I think um, somewhere when, when Acolin started, especially also in the distribution network management and on, on every type of notification services we do provide, not only in Switzerland, but also Europe, Europe and Switzerland were the main target. So as a Swiss company, we came from Switzerland, of course, connectivity, the UBS, Credit Suisse, these type of things. Finally, secondly, then we developed Europe. Now, of course, we, we have now more and more demand to the Latin American market, which we do establish currently. And uh, for 2018, somewhere on the agenda is then to really enter in Asian market. So somewhere Acklin wants to become a global provider. So somewhere it could also be the US on the mutual fund market side, also things there do move maybe in the future that somewhere also European funds could be distributed on the mutual fund markets in the US. So main target of course was Europe and Switzerland. Now we do enlarge and grow this to Asia and also to, to, uh, to other markets so that we can be a global player. Well, I wish you every success with that continued expansion. In the meantime, thank you so much for coming to London and congratulations on the award. Thank you very much again thank and really an honour for, for me to be here. Thank you very much. Thank you.